This is CBS 6 News. Developing right now, reports of a teenager stabbed in Albany. We're told the call went out about two hours ago for an incident at the intersection of First and Quail. That's about a block from Bleecker Stadium. Craig Smith is on the scene right now. Craig, what are you learning right now? Well, we know this is a 17-year-old who was stabbed in the back, and we don't know his condition at this time. The police spokesman, Stephen Smith, said this happened around 3 o'clock behind me. As you said, first in Quail, essentially in front of Mr. Sam, the corner store here. Smith says members of the Albany Fire Department tended to the person who was stabbed, and he was taken to Albany Medical Center. Officer Smith didn't have any details to share when he was asked about who they might be looking for or what a motive might have been. Marlon Anderson is someone who lives near here. He's a regular at City Hall. He came over to us and shared his thoughts about how this kind of behavior might be stopped. Especially when, when I came up, there was all type of organizations, all type of opportunities to do something constructive with my free time. As the saying goes, idle hands are the devil's workshop. And in this community, we have too many idle hands, be it idle from unemployment, be it idle from lack of community centers and community organizations, valid community organizations, valid community centers. That is the problem. We, we need major community reform in this community. As Marlon Anderson, he said he thinks it'll take time, money, and common sense to get this kind of violence to the point where it just doesn't happen anymore. We're live in Albany, Craig Smith, CBS 6 News.